Now joining us is a good friend of mine, host of the Emmy Award winning show, The Doctors, Dr. Travis Stork. Now, in addition to being the uh, host of The Doctors, he is also the author of The Lose Your Belly Diet, Change Your Gut, Change Your Life. And this book will be in stores on December 27th, but I wanted him here now for a reason. Uh, you can buy a copy while you're watching this show by going to thebooknook.com right now. And both Ghost Mountain Books and thebooknook.com are owned in part by my son Jay, in full disclosure. The Lose Your Belly Diet is not really a diet, but more of a lifestyle of healthy eating. And that's why I say this has a real important part here. And let me tell you something. I strongly believe that not a year from now, not two years from now, not five years from now, but 90 days from now, your life can look a whole lot different because I'm getting ready to bring you some stormtroopers that you're not going to believe. And it starts with you. It starts with you because, Lizzie, look, there, if you don't value yourself, you're never going to to do better in your life by your own definition. Everybody has a personal truth and we generate the results in our life that we think we deserve. And you not taking care of yourself physically is just a symptom of not valuing yourself overall. I think that it all starts from the inside out. And so I asked Dr. Stork to be here today because I think it begins with focus, and I think it begins with focus on yourself, valuing yourself, and treating yourself well. You're, I'm not talking about this aesthetic. She's not healthy right now. With carrying this much weight, she's not healthy right now. True? Absolutely true. I think a lot of times people think about losing weight strictly from a vanity perspective. And one of the reasons I wrote this book, and I talk about it on the doctors all the time, is it's about so much more than that. And we're learning in medicine, obviously carrying too much weight puts you at risk for all the chronic illnesses. It puts you at risk for a premature death. But what we're learning now is so much about also how much weight we carry and where, where we carry it also plays a huge role in our emotional well-being, how we feel about ourselves. And I, I think bringing that all together is a really important thing that we don't, we don't often do that in medicine. And that's one of the things that, that obviously I wrote the book for and the benefits are clear. I mean, you do lose weight, you do have more energy, you do sleep better, you do have better digestion, it does boost your metabolism, there's less inflammation in your body, it strengthens your immune system, uh, and there's lower risk of chronic disease, a lower risk of the potential killers that we deal with, right? Which we're talking about heart disease, diabetes, certain types of cancers, all of these things, and that's what you're worried about, and by the way, I grabbed a little freeze frame of a picture of you just a second ago in the video. Can we see that? Okay. Um, not exactly the best profile. Correct. Right. And you got half and half in your hand. Had some coffee that morning. Yeah. Uh, so this is something that from a role modeling perspective, we could do as a family here. Did you ever think you'd be in this shape? No, never. I mean, this is, you, you've got to be shocked about this. Absolutely. And do something for me. Stand up. Okay. I want you to get on the other side of this stool. Over here. Okay. We're going to pick this up. Pick it up. Okay. Just hold it. You're carrying over 100 pounds. What do you think a stool weighs? About that. It weighs about 40 pounds. Really? Yeah. You're two times that is how much you're carrying around with you every minute of every hour of every day. Think that would wear you out if I had you carry this the rest of the day? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You're not valuing yourself. 